Hello everyone, you must welcome to this platform. We're going to look at P6 English and in this form we're going to start with what we call traffic dangers. This traffic dangers is a subtopic of safety on the road. Under this one, we're going to look at some vocabularies. For example, we have We have under this topic you can bring accidents. Apart from accidents, you can bring another word which is the crossroads. And roundabout. You can also bring in traffic. Under this traffic, you can call it traffic lights or traffic signal or the word traffic itself. Then you can also have the word junction. We also have island. Let's first look at only these ones. We are going to look at their meanings. For example, don't get accidents. Accident, you can say a sudden happening. Meanings. Accidents, you can say, you can define it as a sudden happening that can cause death or and that's the way you can find an accident. Then, from this one, since you are in English, you should be able to construct a sentence on this one. But there are very many sentences you can pull from this one. But since we have less time, I'm not going to construct a sentence. I'm let's look at another one, which is the crossroads. Crossroads. Let me draw for you a diagram to show the crossroads. This is what you call a crossroad. This point here, where two roads meet and cross each other. That's what you call crossroads. Crossroads, not crossroad. Mark that point. Therefore, we would say crossroads. Number two, crossroads. Is a place where two roads meet and cross each other. That's what we call crossroads. Is a place, we use is because this one is one word, not two words. Therefore, we're going to look at another one, which is a roundabout. Roundabout is number three. A roundabout. We call it, let me first draw for you a diagram so that you are able to differentiate. This is what we call a round about. A place where two or more roads meet in a circular form. That's what we call a round about. Therefore, 
the definition of a roundabout is this a place where two or more roads meet and four meet in a circular form. That's what we call a rounding about. Then we have another one which is a traffic. This traffic, the vehicles that you see on the road, in that fleet of vehicles, each vehicle you can call it a traffic. Therefore, in this word traffic, most of you know traffic jam, traffic lights, and so on. Let's look at one of them. We have traffic lights. I guess all of you have seen me or oh, you have heard of traffic lights. There are traffic lights. Let me draw for you here a drawing so that you can able to see. This are called traffic lights. They are normally having three colors, red, green and orange and each color stands for a different purpose for example red can say red stop orange get ready then green you can say go therefore these plant crates we find them as the signal the signal that controls that controls the traffic the traffic the traffic here you mean the vehicles on the road that's what we call the traffic lights This one's gonna finish them. Then we have what you call the junction. This is our number five. The junction. Junction. This junction can be defined as a place where Two or more roads meet, but do not cross each other. I can give you a drawing here. It can be like this here. There's a difference between this drawing and this one. This one is crossroads and this one is a junction. They meet but they don't cross each other. You can also draw here another road. That's what I've said. Two or more. But they shouldn't cross each other. Then we have what you call an island. This island, its short form is, that's the short form of the word island. I'm not meaning the island of the water bodies, I'm meaning the island of roads. Its 
illustration or its diagram can be like this. This are rod. For example, this is like a table road. When you are crossing a table road, you have to see are there vehicles coming? Is it safe? This one, this part, is it safe? When you see that it is safe, you cross. Then you stand at this point. And this point is what we call the island. This point here. Therefore, we can say an island is a place is a place in the middle of the road where you must stop before crossing the other part of the road. At this point, I can also add you another vocabulary under this track key. The, another vocabulary can be highway code. This highway code, sometimes they start it with capital H and capital C. The moment you see that they are started with these capitals, you must also start with capital letters, not that one. If you see that this one they have started with capital letter, you also have start with capital letters. You must follow the rubrics, all the rules, the procedures. Therefore, this highway code can be defined as a book that has rules of the road. Oh, you can say it's a set of instructions that govern the drivers and road users. Let's, let's give that definition also. You can say a set or rules that govern the drivers or road users. These road users, you can say, the pedestrians uh, and all other people who use the road, apart from the drivers, the motorists, the cyclists, and so on. All those are under road users. Whoever uses the road is called a road user. After this one, so we're going to look at more vocabulary under this traffic. After this lesson, I shall give you an activity. You shall find it on our school website. Thank you so much for listening. I wish you the best.